Okay, welcome to a new episode of Resolute Fitness. It is Wednesday hum day and it's the evening session here in North Carolina. Uh, still going through the lockdown, so we are working out in the front room. Today's evening workout is one I've been wanting to do for a while actually. Uh, Joseph March Banks Jr. found on Wadwell. Um, simple setup, four time. It is 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Reps of alternating dumbbell snatches and handstand push ups. So you're going to do 10 of the snatches, 10 of the handstand push ups, 9, 9, 8, 8, all the way through to 1. So simple setup. Uh, all, dumbbell weight for, for men's 75 pounds. Um, I think it's like around 50 for, for females. So I'm going to be doing the 50 pound dumbbell because that's all I've got, but I'm going to be using the fat grips. So it just makes it a lot more taxing on your um, on your forearms. Handstand press up, so I'm going to do kipping ones. If you want to make it harder and want to do strict, by all means do that. If you can't do handstand press ups and you want to do a pike push up, you can do that. Or one where you've got your feet up on a chair or window ledge or something. But we'll go through the movements in a second, but yeah, we'll get started. It shouldn't take too long, this. I haven't got the greatest handstand push up, so that's going to be the thing that slows me down. Boom. Beautiful. Right, demos. First movement is the dumbbell alternating snatches. Like I said, I've got the fat grip on. Um, it just makes it a lot wider and sort of meatier to try and get hold of. Um, but snatch is just going to be from the floor. I'm going to be doing single head that touches the floor and then it's up above her and then swap. If you'd rather bring it down and change hands like that, you can do it. But I'm going to try and alternate um, depending on my other grip. And some push ups. So, if you don't have them, but you've, um, you're close and you want to use something like a ledge and do a pike, you can do that also. And if you don't feel comfortable with that and would rather do a pike press up, you can do that also. Ooh, so, a few different alternatives. And if you can't do it from your feet and want to do it from your knees, you can go from there, you can do that. Whatever version you want to do. Whatever you want. Do whatever you want. No judgment. No judgment. Okay, right. Resolute fitness. We don't judge. Okay, here's the workout. Boom. Boom. That's good. Okay, uh, we're about to start. We've got the timer here. Emily's going to click it in a second and then we start with the dumbbell uh, snatches. So, yeah. Um, good luck. Wednesday evening here. We'll yeah. smash through this, do it the best you can. I'll probably have to um, split up the handstand push ups. I can't go unbroken for that many. Um, so I'll just try and do like big chunks and then towards the end it'll, it'll sort of go a bit smaller. But we'll see. So good luck, enjoy, and see you on the other side. Oh boy.
gonna stop your music. So you can put that. Yeah. He just finished. Fifteen thirty-one was his time. Yeah. Oh, do you want to grab your computer? Oh. oh. Okay. Just finished. Um. Like Emily just said, what was it? Fifteen thirty-one. Yeah. Fifteen thirty-one. Um. Workout that I've I've been looking forward to, but I have this like niggling. Um. I don't know. Sort of like a weird sciatic thing and um it can it can come and go and it's um uh it just slows slows me down because it basically sort of lower back near your sort of tailbone um my left glute oh god and my calf will will um will sort of cramp um will you grab Molly Molly come here Molly <laughs> Oh. Sit, please. So it makes it super uncomfortable, but I find like I don't know if I stop all the time when when I feel it, I, I just frustrate me. So I'd rather just try and battle through it. As long as it's not um like a sharper sharper pain, um then I obviously would I would stop. Um, but yeah, it was a good workout though. I was I was flying up until seven for me, and then like I said, that's when that's when I sort of felt it. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna stretch now. Um, I think I think for me I could maybe do that in around 12 minutes without this back thing. Um, but it'd be interesting. Oh my god, what? Molly, you're doing my nutting. Do you your breath smells. <laughs> right, just be good. Right, I'm gonna just get her in a head lock. It's National Rescue Dog Day today. So, these are both rescue dogs. Yeah. One in California and one in uh, Carolina. Yep. Molly's in California. She actually found in Mexico. So she's a Mexican dog, but she adopted her in California. Oh. Yeah. We've not been, not been able to show her for a while, I have know. we? Oh. Corn dog's getting very. He's getting big. He's still super skinny. I'm going to ask the vet if he needs to eat more. I'm not sure. But oh, oh, my God. He's a good boy. It's really difficult to um, <laughs> sit with this back oh, and Molly attacking you. Oh dear. Um, Goodness, are you lifting the weight? That's weird. No, All right. It's sort of carnage here now. <laughs> so that is me for another day. Um, thank you for watching. If you can like, subscribe. Cornelius is now eating all the um, electric stuff, oh, by the way. Great. Daddy. Cornelius, don't eat that. That was getting fixed earlier today. Great. I'm getting licked to how <laughs> hell here. Um, yeah, good workout. I'll be back tomorrow. I'm going to stretch and sort of try and fix this, this lower back issue. But yeah, have a good, um, good evening. Um, yeah, keep going, keep safe, keep healthy. You can like, subscribe, helps the channel massively. Um, I appreciate everything you do. Oh yeah, what is this? Bye, bye. Bye, bye.